Both Devon and Oleg anticipate that their supermatch will be a tough and challenging fight. Devon praises the legitimacy of Oleg's title and feels that this match holds special meaning due to Oleg's connection to Pushkar. Devon has a deep admiration and respect for Pushkar, who is Oleg's mentor. Devon also notes that he's in his best shape for this 105 kilogram weight category. Devon has tried to apply psychological pressure on Oleg, hinting that he plans to replicate and perhaps even exceed the dominance he displayed over Pushkar. Additionally, Devon comments that the match will stop and Oleg will end up giving in. On his side, Oleg wants to prove he's the best in the 105 kilogram category and it's also a match for revenge since his mentor Pushkar lost to Devon. Oleg acknowledges Devon's strength and has been preparing for a long battle, though his main strategy remains to secure a quick win. Oleg claims he's in 5-10% to better shape than when he faced on Garbath. He admits that his game plan centers on controlling the hand and applying side pressure, but if his wrist begins to fail, he has backup strategies in place, possibly the flop wrist press. He also admits that the way Devon defeated Pushkar angered him, serving as extra motivation for his training. Oleg states he's mentally prepared and will not give up under any circumstances. Devon appears confident of victory, especially after analyzing Oleg's remarks during their conversation. He believes that Oleg's assessment of both their abilities will ultimately cost him the win. Furthermore, if Devon successfully cuts 10 kilograms in seven days, he will have a weight and size advantage over Oleg on match day, as Oleg only needs to shed a maximum of two kilograms in the week leading up. While the conversation was filled with jokes and provocations, both fighters expressed mutual respect. Despite the intensity of the rivalry, they plan to spend some time together before the match, though keeping a bit of distance in the last two days to focus on the competition.